Hello everyone, welcome along to our open evening, albeit a virtual one. Uh, the purpose of this is to give you a sense of what our school is like, uh, to see all the various subjects in action, to see the young people enjoying the learning in those subjects. So rather than having uh, a real uh, open evening, which we usually have, this is the best we can do. Uh, so we do hope that you enjoy this virtual open evening and you get a real sense of what it's like to be a pupil in Lindsay Academy. Thank you. Hi everyone, my name is Russell Emery and I am the Principal Teacher of PE at Lindsay Academy. Here we have collated a number of pictures and videos of various activities and lessons showing you all what we offer at Lindsay Academy. I hope you enjoy the presentation and I look very much to welcoming you here next year. At Lindsay Academy we design and implement PE lessons that are specifically tailored to meet the needs of all learners. The PE staff structure their lessons around the inclusion of multiple significant aspects of learning, such as respect, concentration and confidence. Throughout the PE department, we follow the guidance on using Education Scotland's benchmarks for assessment. This allows us to deliver meaningful lessons to help progress our pupils through each stage of physical education. By delivering S2 elective and S3 PE studies, it presents opportunities for our pupils to gain experiences of what our national qualification classes are like. Our national qualification courses are split between theoretical and practical lessons. Practical lessons involve pupils applying theory to practice. They will learn about factors impacting performance and how they can develop their performances across various activities. Furthermore, pupils can progress onto advanced hire, where they will gain essential experiences of what college and university has in store for them. We are a proud member of being a school of rugby. This is implemented across all of our year groups. This year we have gained success as we have seen our under 15s win their domestic league. As well as delivering PE in school, we also offer various extracurricular activities that all pupils can join. These clubs vary from football, hockey, table tennis, basketball, dance, netball and trampoline. Thank you very much for watching and we'll see you all in 2022.
Hello, I'm Philip Schofield, a second year pupil in Lindsay Academy and I want to tell you a bit about what PSC will include. So you get PSC once a week from first to fifth year with your guidance teacher you'll have from first year onwards. So in PSC you'll cover certain topics such as sexual education, drug awareness, stress, how to study for exams, LGBTQ plus history, consent and racism. friends in all of the different subjects and I've mostly enjoyed HFT in business because in HFT you get to do lots of cooking and in business you get to go and work in science where we've been doing lots of experiments and learning a lot we've been doing an energy topic to start and then I've also enjoyed PE where we've had lots of equipment so far we've done hockey and gymnastics it's been quite good. dancing club and it's really good because you get to meet other people from different years that like enjoy the same things you do. Good. And I also do an after school football club where we get to um, do training and then you, if you're good enough you get to get picked for the team and the team takes part in competitions such as the Scottish Cup. We went to Auckland Gillen and we did lots of different activities there and we also got to meet other people from our house. Good. Yeah, we did quite a bit. We did climbing, we also did uh, grass legend, archery and laser tag, so it was real fun. So your guidance teacher is, so you see them once a week, uh, every week, and they're just mostly there to like help you if you like have any problems. And so far we've talked about bullying, mental health and how to be safe on bonfire night. Uh, and also, if you ever have any worries, you can listen, you can just give your game teacher maybe an email or ask them ask if you can speak to them. So they're really just there if you need any help or just if you want to see a familiar face or anything. So really, the first thing is nothing to worry about because. Uh, your guidance teacher and lots of teachers start to help you along the way and you just get to meet lots of new people and it's really nothing to worry about. Yeah, we spent the first two or three periods in our, uh, with our guidance teacher and we would, uh, then we went into a normal day so you were really eased into it. You'd have a guide with you so you don't need to worry about getting lost so you'd be able to find your way around the school. You should, like, if you're worried, you should you could talk to someone, but there's really nothing to worry about because there'll be lots of people to help you and there's like so many new opportunities. Yeah. I'd say just enjoy your time and try and make as many friends as possible because there's so many opportunities like in all the clubs. So always just try and talk to people, see if you've got something in common and just that could be a new friend.